I started Symphony Entertainment LLC and Game Face Records LLC in the early 2000s. During this time, I produced and managed 10 different artists, all while promoting my own solo career. In 2010, I moved to Atlanta, and since then I have worked with dozens of artists as a photographer, videographer, and graphic designer. Music has always been an integral part of my whole life. Welcome to Air Reviews. What up, world? Welcome back to Ill Reviews, man. You already know what time it is, man. We're about to get into this boss man, d -Lo. But as you can see, I got a very, very special guest in the building. I'm going to let him tell y'all who he is and what he got going on. What's going on, man? It's your boy Lil Rick, a.k.a. Mr. New Wave. I'm different. Let's get it, man. Jeff from Millersville, Georgia. Just blessed to be here. Truly great to be here, man. Thank you for having me. Man, it ain't no thing. It ain't no thing. What you been doing since that last time we uh, linked up with that, uh, what's her name? Keys to the Streets? Oh man, since then, really, I've just been on a spiritual journey, man. Just been praying a lot, you know, working on new music. Got a couple of new albums, a couple of things I got planned for next year, definitely. Okay, okay. So st stay tuned, because after we do this review, um, Lil Rick, Rick is going to tell y'all some more about what he got going on. You know what I'm saying? But we got to get into this uh, Boss Man d -Lo. We know why y'all here. We know why y'all here, you feel? So what you think about Boss Man, you feel me, and his old movement as an artist and his music? You know what I'm saying? What you think about, bro? Uh, man, I love the movement, man. I'm mm -hmm. great to see him on the up, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I don't really know much, but you know, I like I like the craft. I respect the craft and I respect the music be vibes. This music be vibing. Like, I think uh, I like, uh, what's that first song? Get In With Me? Oh, yeah. I like that. I like uh, Finesse with him and Glorilla. Yeah, yeah. Mr. Pot Scraper. Uh, <laughs> dope Man. Mr. Dope Man. Yeah, bro. Hey, he he got, he got some hits. Hey, so I think he's he gonna have some more hits on here, though, because. He just in that zone right now, and yeah. it's crazy he cooked up, like clicked up with Glorilla because she's in the zone right now too. And them on the tracks together, that shit been hitting though. Hey, you feel man. me? But in case y'all don't know who Bossman D'Lo is, uh, he's a 26 year old artist out of Florida, and it says here he signs to Alamo Records. You feel me? So yeah, let's get into it. So this episode of Ill Music Reviews is brought to you by Making It For Indies, the number one platform connecting indie talent and industry tastemakers. DM them the word brand for help getting real exposure, paid shows, and features. They've been doing it since 2007. If you're an artist and you're not sure which way to go, they punch you in the right direction and they legit. My God, is Kelby. It's my guy. He's been my guy for about 20 years. How let me get you right for sure. All right, now we're about to get into this album. The first song is called D'Lo Curry. Let's check it out. But shit, I'm on a new wave. New wave, so new sir. Boy. Runner, I switch cars like I switch socks. But I stay down, now I'm at the top. Two tall of big rocks. Hold on, is it me? Do that beat sound a little low though? Hey, turn it up a little bit. Yeah, can. I mean, it's turned up, but it sounds like the beat is like in the background. And one thing I, I was gonna say about him is he know how to pick good beats. That's part of you know what I'm saying. A lot of niggas can rap, but they don't know how to pick good beats. Yeah. He picked some sliders, but this would sound kind of low. Let me see if I can turn it up. Diamonds doing too much shine. I don't know what time it is. Apply pressure when they see me. They know what time it is. Boy, last night, bad bitch. She get first class flight. She act right. I done signed a deal, but I'm still smoking like fifty a G. Fifteen thousand. Put that shit off. Pull up. How about black truck? Look like I. Yeah, I don't know what you think about that intro, just off top jumping out, out the gate. Um, how can I really say it? it like, I feel like he could have went harder. I ain't yeah. gonna lie. He definitely could have had a harder intro. You feel me? Like, I like when the intro just really set it off. You know what I'm saying? Put your one of your hardest songs on first. That song sounded like it was about to be cool, but it really ain't. You know what I'm saying? It ain't really getting me hyped to really get into the project. Yeah. You feel me? So let's go to the next one, track two. Like that. And it's 20 tracks, so I'm gonna go kind of fast because I don't want this video to be like 50 minutes long or something crazy. So, yeah, we're gonna keep it moving. Track two, like that. Bitch, just know you lucky. I remember I was fucked up. Now I got cheese like Chuggy. I'm married to the money. Yeah, boy, I'm like that. He went out of my baguette. Diamonds make her pussy wet. And on these niggas, I'm D Lo Moran. Come here, baby. I want you to be my baby. Yeah, you gonna play with who? I got all this drip, look like a bird shit. She say that pussy water. Okay, track two like that. I ain't gonna lie, I'm fucking with that one. You fucking with that I'm one? I'm fucking with that one. You'll pump, you'll like bump it in the whip? Yeah, like, I, I definitely would. That nigga said bottom like a, what do you say, bro? He said dunking on Something like uh, Morant. He yeah. He called Morant, but yeah. He, that's, this shit hard. hard. It's hard. It's hard. It's better than that first one, though. Yeah. But uh, I'm looking for something a little bit harder, you feel me? You yeah. know what I'm saying? And then 
It looked like he just rapping without even like really dropping no hooks. You know what I'm saying? It's like he just rapping straight. You can you can kind of tell he just like when he hit a beat, he just going. Yeah, that's what it is. Because you know I I feel like a lot of time as an artist, you hear like people telling you that you should probably try to rap this way, yeah. try to rap that way, and people be like, you got to switch it up. Yeah. But it's like if it worked for you, it worked for you. You feel me? Like if yeah. it's for you, it's for you. It's your style. Fuck what everybody else trying to say. You feel me? It seems like, like he on somebody he might not have been trying to really make a song like you know what I'm saying like hook bars hook bars it sound like he just wanted to just go you know what I'm saying just go on the beat and just yeah. like a freestyle you feel me yeah I get it I get it my folks do that shit all the time so let's yeah. keep it going track three Pillsbury D Lo featuring Ice Spice that's interesting said Ice Spice D made the motherfucker here. <laughs> I'm sorry that's your girl, but she coming with me. I say, baby, it's your world. I call her a Disney. Rich nigga, baby, stop fucking with them lame. I can be at an arcade, baby, I still don't play no games. I say, baby, it's your world. I call her a Disney. Call me Pillsbury D. Straight so far, I'm going to see what Ice Spice is about to do. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But I did have this song, uh, I think it's called, I forgot what it's called. But she was actually skating, and I was surprised. It was on her last album. There's one song on there, I was like, nah, she killed that one. Um, I forgot the name of it. Let's see what Ice Spice do to this beat, though. Hello, I need more dough. Drop the top in that double R. Let your hair blow. That's the worst way. Saying you don't like rich niggas chicken. That's a poor taste. Ain't nobody here for me. Ain't nobody here for me. Ain't nobody here for me. I'm like, are you sure, bills? I like hundred dollar bills. Real right, and I'm built nice. Got yeah. minutes bills, sitting pretty. I put on that shit for real. Broke hoes don't even know the name. Like, call these friends. Okay, what you think about that one? I ain't gonna lie, I spice the prime. Is she slamming that bitch on film some sort of shit? Yeah, she did lie. the uh, kind of like lazy, like laid back delivery too. Yeah, it was straight though. I'm rocking with it. That shit was cool. Feel about it. Ain't gonna bullshit. Track four is Mo Chicken featuring French Montana. This might be the one that I've been waiting on. This one, <laughs> this one in, though. I was like, okay. I was like, Catch up with me. I saw a bitch. I blow fit. I'm a fat nigga. Big Zop, baby. I got a slap wood full of runs. I'm spending 6,000 on shoes. I can only wear them bitches once. Like diamonds on me moonwalking. 10 points I'm hitting on same nigga that pissed me off, look at me now, shit, no Fuck running, catch up with me, I stack hundreds, I blow fifties I'm a fat nigga, give me more chicken, I'm running it ripping, this a lamb truck And I don't think French Mountain gonna mess it up, keep that seat, if I was him, I would flow with the same pattern uh, D-Lo used mm -hmm. Just do that same pattern and, and then she can go Yeah, he might yeah, I'm shit And you know it take money Fuck bitches Big money I talk different Cause they got more money than my bitches She drink water And my her business I push up on them The keys and it came from overseas Need a billion bitch When I die I let my body freeze Fuck bitches Yo, that shit was hard I That nigga did that little <laughs> razzle dazzle on that motherfucker And this song on a TikTok and shit Watch it's gonna pop up on some shit. That nigga <laughs> said, get money, fuck bitches. That nigga slide on that bitch. No cow. That nigga said, his diamonds be kickboxing. Oh, yeah. like, <laughs> That's crazy. That motherfucker punch back. <laughs> Let's keep it going. Keep it going. Track five is the biggest part two. I might have heard this before. Fuck by number getting paid. You wanna catch up with me on the interstate. Switch your lane, catch a play like a head coach. Oh, break your arm. You can't walk a mile in these new Louis Vuittons. Anytime the crackers run up, I run. Anytime I piss on ice cold, baby, check the thermostat. Ice cold, I don't need no free on. Yeah, that's it. That's it. That's another hit. Yeah. Yeah, I like that. No bullshit. You got two on there. I'm really feeling so far. Let's keep it going. Track 646th Street. Mayor, drill. As soon as I hop out the wheel, your bitch gon' disappear. Catch me on the highway, switching lanes and switching gears. I'll be where the bosses is. I see all that ass, baby. Let me see how soft it is. Move your broke ass out of the way. Tell them let the bosses in. Better go beat traffic. I'm a dope stretcher. Fucking power play catcher. A trout nigga. I'm a surf. Think about that one, 46th Street. Mmm. I don't know, it just, it ain't hit for me, I ain't even gonna lie to you. Like, like the other ones. Like, the beat was hard, but mm -hmm. 
Yeah, I ain't really. I wouldn't even listen to what he was saying for real. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> <laughs> they know they can just throw a filler track out there. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Just make them. Just make them. You know what I'm saying? The money. Yeah. The <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You already know the game. You know yeah, the game. Got to. Got to. Track seven. Starlight. Like with that last one, like he he had the energy. Like he didn't have the energy, but he had the energy. Yeah. This one, he got the energy. That's what I'm saying. The other one was a filler track. This one, like he really, you know what I'm saying, trying to put in like. Cause he, he's saying some shit like mm -hmm. you can hear the punchlines when he rap for real. Yeah, exactly. And then sometimes you phone it in. Yeah, let's keep going. I'm in LA shooting dice. They go 12. I'm up. If they hit the lights, I was down bad. I finally get nigga. 20k at once. I can show you how to make it rain. Yeah. Ask about D-Lo in the streets. Nigga, I don't play no game. Walk straight out the airport. Hopped in a black truck. I'm a all day roll running, trapping, trapping ass nigga. I'm a dog shit talking, old bragging ass nigga. <laughs> Half a meal cash on me. I done lost my damn top. Uh, yeah. Is he a bragging ass nigga? <laughs> Stop playing with that boy. Let's keep going. Track eight, cash shit. Donald Trump. I got in the trap. Ran it up fast like I'm Forrest Gump. It's me and you in this coupe. Let's just ride, baby. My girls, you with a rich nigga or not, baby? First class flights. Baby, let's take trips. Baby, here go 500. Go get fresh tips. Mo chronic. I'ma run a sack up, call me d lo I'm so damn rich, I talk cash shit, I drive fast shit <laughs> I fuck with that That nigga said, I drive fast shit Yeah, it's his delivery, his delivery hard you Yeah, he said I'm d -Lo Sonic. <laughs> Let's keep going, track 9, game one That's dope Be a dog, we don't need no meows, we don't need no cats We need more dogs that nigga come over and come to the funny Say. Ain't really come to play, but you come get in with me. That's okay. gonna be your lucky day. Yo. You ain't talking about no money, make it quick. I'm running late, applying straight pressure. You can't play no games with them. Plug, no, to throw it to me. I might throw this one hey, on. Like, I like this, that beat this though. One on, this one, no one. This beat sliding too. Yeah. I'ma do my thing with them. That pussy good. I and stay down. You ain't my brother, I can't trust you. 200 can chain, diamonds dancing just like Usher. Yeah. When they say my name, they know I'm a real hoe. Sexy baby, what you doing? Let me fly you out. I'm trying to make a play. I ain't really come to play. Yeah, that game winner hitting, though. I rock with that one. Oh, that shit's smooth. Let's keep it going, though. We got 10 more tracks. Track 10 called Big. Would you like him to keep this formula or you think he should switch it up and try like a different kind of beat? You know what I'm saying? Like mm. try to get outside the box or just keep recycling what works every single song? I mean, I'm a, I'm a if it works, it works kind of guy. Yeah. But I'm also like a, I'm a versatile artist. So mm -hmm. it's like I can't really, you know what I'm saying, tell Stay. him what to do or how yeah. to do or what I think he should do. It's like. I think uh, mm -hmm. if you drop too many albums that's all just like this without even stepping outside the box, it's gonna get repetitive. Yeah, I think a consistent, a consistent type of beat could yeah. be a bad thing, but yeah. a consistent flow on different beats could yeah. do. You know what I'm saying? It could. It's better than having the same type of beats. Right. Because then it's like you become depth to it. Like you become like it's kind of like being nose blind. Like you always yeah. smelling the same shit all the time. Then you walk in the room one day and you just don't smell it no more. Exactly, yeah. But you know it's still there. Mm -hmm. It's like that with music. Too. I like, I like, but I think the way the game is now, a lot of artists are scared to step, step out of their zone and try something a little different. You know what I'm saying? Because they feel like the niggas in the comments like, damn, niggas, go back to your old, wait, oh, you know what I'm saying? Your mm -hmm. old subject matter, your old beats. Like, but yeah. niggas gonna sooner or later, he gonna wanna try to do a pop song maybe, you know what I'm saying? Or he might try to do a gospel song. Like, yeah. I like niggas getting out the box after a while. Because that's what happened to the baby to me. You know what I'm saying? I feel like he can rap. But it started like after that fourth album was like, damn, all these songs like the exact same subject matter. When I like when I started peeping, he was changing. That's mm -hmm. when I kind of got off yeah. a little bit. But it's like if I see something like pop up on my timeline, this with him, and I hear it, yeah. and I be like, okay, this nigga still slide. Mm -hmm. You know, it just it ain't mainstream no more, and ain't never wrong yeah. with that. It just 
it's the times, man. Like yeah. you got all, uh, like you got Six and Red, Glorilla, and all them, and you've been in the game for a while. You just got your audience who just mm-hmm. tap into your shit because they your fans. Right. Like when you when you hot for real, you gonna see who dare, who real, and who ain't when you not. And everybody can't cross over like that. Everybody can't cross over like Drake or uh, the Young Thug. Like Young Thug be hot, like, making songs with Camila Cabello and shit. Yeah. <clears throat> you know what I'm saying? Like everybody can't do that. Some people gotta stay in their lane. You yeah. feel me? So it is what it is. Let's keep on listening to Big, see what we think about though. Take it. Bro, Mr. Spain up, bro. I love you, DZ. Maybe I got big diamonds. Fuck a vet, pull up TRX. We love big bodies. We ain't gonna worry about what we make it. Bitches had their nuts crossed. I sell them flat screen, interior, duck sauce. Switching up my car so them folk don't know a play catcher. Run it up crazy. Apply straight pressure. Pull up in some van. This shit smooth as fuck, man. Like, that bit, that bit, that like, it got, um, you can ride late night, like, on It's got to be a late night, because I'm trying to figure out the the beat. I'm like, damn, do I want to hear this in the club with that beat? Nah, it, it, it'll, it got to be a certain type of mood. Like, you can't just put that on. Yeah, DJ can't throw that at the club one o'clock in the morning, really, huh? Nah, nah. Yeah, you got to like smooth, he probably, he probably can, but it's like, you got to deliver it a certain yeah. way. Yeah. You know like, what I'm like saying? Said, I think it's more like a ride in the night type song, you know what I'm saying? That's yeah. where that song fits to me. Let's keep it moving though. Track 11, motion. Not it, we got heavy motion. I'm smoking on cat piss, 3 5 when I roll up. I'm swinging in trash film. Niggas pump fading, they ain't having not even a little. Niggas see niggas hating, it don't even matter, I'm still that nigga. I'm screaming free to real. Big diamond chain on me, baby. You don't need your purse. Everything on me, baby. She say I dress. Motion. But you think that motion? That nigga definitely talking that shit like he got motion. He's skating, he's skating. You feel me? I rock with that one. I don't know if it's gonna be my one of my favorites, but it was straight. It'll be one of the ones that's like, like it's a sleeper. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Like you listen to that enough, that's one of the ones that you just yeah. I'm no, told for real. Facts, facts. We gonna keep it <clears> one. <throat> Track twelve is called PJ featuring Lil Baby. Let's go, Lil Baby. Mm-hmm. Oh shit! Okay. Damn. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, phone ain't got no service, I'm on a PJ shooting night. Wearing yeah. fifty dollars to my name and fifty K a night. No plan time, I be with them shit poppers. Ice on I'm outside, pockets full of cheese, nigga. Fresh. Okay, this straight so far, you know what I'm saying? I like in the beat. But I really, really at this point, I'm like, I already know what boss man gonna say. I mean, I'm ready to see what little baby gonna say because it's been a little while. Yeah, he's been real really quiet since the whole so thing. Might, I ain't gonna lie. He might kill like what a little baby talking about. Him. Type Shut him for breeze, nigga. Yeah. Smelling like some baby. You could be my bitch. All the times I've been in handcuffs, shit, I had to bust my wrist. Yeah. On the PJ uh-huh. show, on dice with D-Lo spot up. And she might know some shit. Yeah. Right now, spot this bitch on fire. Another house for holy spirit. I'm the illest baby. Yeah. And the realest baby. Yeah. I'm a 55 pound, but I'm the biggest baby. Yeah. I'm the teeny baby. Watch me. I'm gonna get this money beat up when I finish, baby. I call it. I came a long that way from London. I'm gonna get tons, this money dude. be there when I finish, baby. I swear to God, every hustler gotta feel that. I oh swear God, to God, I used to tell my girl that I, I'm gonna be back, man. Mm, this man, money be boy, here when I finish, though. Gotta make yo. this shit move one way or another. That motherfucker got to move, boy. Dead ass, yo. That was nice, though. Thank you, skating on that. Let's keep it going, though. Track 13, Out the Mud. Twelve, fuck the state, fuck the judge. judge. I'ma buy a monster trunk cause I made it out the mud. Time, pull up big body, hop out smelling like bond, I'm a line. Buy my money, I'm pushing up, I'm big zada. And I'm screaming, fuck the police, and I'm standing on it. Uh, come here, I'ma bless you, baby. Lift the doors up. Strike 13 out the mud, what you thought of that one? It was smooth. It was smooth? Yeah, it was smooth. yeah I thought it was smooth. I like the beat. But I don't know if he picked up the right rhyme pattern or something. Something that was off. I was like, with that beat, I was just expecting it to hit a little harder. He had cadence. He, he could have did a different cadence. You think that might have been it? That's what it was. Because that beat called for a special, like, probably a special cadence, a certain rhyme pattern. Yeah. You got like, he got, like, I, like, you know, he got good beat selections. Yeah. It's just, you got to, he ain't hit bag, but you got to get in your bag. You know what I mean? <laughs> right. Like, it's, it's easy to be like, oh yeah, I'm on this bitch. I'm in mean, my bag, but you gotta be like, you gotta say some different shit. Like, nigga, that's, that beat, yeah. that's a beat that like, nigga going through hard times. I gotta yeah, get it out of the mud. That's what it is. Or that's what it is. I couldn't yeah. put my finger on it. I was like, why this ain't hitting me like this? Cause he not really saying what that beat is calling for. Nah. Damn, yeah, you gotta know that as an artist. Sometimes you gonna mess it up though. Sometimes you ain't gonna catch that vibe right. Hey, man. You just gotta, you just gotta, 
<laughs> sit down. You gotta sit down for a minute, man. You gotta listen. Yeah, because I love to like listen to the instrumental and see like what is this beat telling me? Yeah. You feel me? Like how what is it saying? Then you base your subject and your you know what I'm saying shit off of that, that feeling. Yeah. But it is what it is. Let's yeah. keep going, track 14, what you need featuring no cap. Ooh, that's mm, that yeah. nigga boy. I'm dropping that. Nice. Hey, yeah. 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 Nah, you finna learn. <laughs> you finna learn today. Now my pocket stuff like a turkey. <laughs> I'm the motherfucking biggest, but let's make a bet. Bit that came to this yeah. cousin look about a yeah. broke. I'm I'm a ass bitch, tell that. me where you live at. Yeah. I got tired of foreign cars. Four round got a Chevy mountain. Christmas, I told Santa Claus. Just bring me a money counter. Put in the suit. That why they bleed got a butt. I know I shouldn't be missing the family with business. I still get a job to my cousin. I'm out of London with a bad bitch. She bad and she don't hurt for nothing. Shawty got her shit together. My jeweler, he on speed dial. I should slow down on this glitter. Nightmares on that Michael Jackson thriller. Stuff for Billy in my jeans. Come on! Come on, tell me what you need. Yeah, I'm third in the Pull up, hop out. Hey, hey, I don't know if you're gonna see this. I don't know if you're gonna see this, no cap, but if you do, hey, holla at your boy. Nah, he skated, he skated. That ass, boy, oh, Jesus, boy. Hey, that shit was crazy. And then he was doing a little Migo triplet flow for a minute, you feel me? Yes, then he had the little bro. metaphors and shit. Bro, the he punch was just skating was... on me, he just was in that pocket. Yes, bro. Yeah, that was hard. It's like. I ain't even trying to, you know what I'm saying, do too much in there, but like, mm -hmm. bro, like, No Cap is my inspiration for, like, really rapping. I gotta, I gotta get to him. What's his best mixtape? Oh my god. That nigga got, uh, Still Human. He I'm just, gonna go listen to Still Human after this nigga. He dropped, he dropped the album, like, maybe, what it was, like, two years ago, a bit called Mr. Crawford. I've been listening to that. That's your heart? Yo, I'ma listen to it. You feel me? Nigga, this you heard what he did on the feature. Yeah. yeah. That's, this is his <laughs> shit. No. <laughs> it's his song now. Yeah. Let's keep it going. Let's keep it going. Track 15. Pushing up. Yeah. Yeah. Money good, trap swing. I'm beating the pot up like I'm angry. I can run it up with no angles. I got chicken like Bojangles. Punch on the good, I'm deep in them. Deep pussy nigga pre I'm a real screen nigga. Ice and froze, baby. 100K, two shows, baby. I bought my ice when I got hot. I can go make back off the lot. I can pull like a Honda. Niggas hang the bag. I'm a fucking G Wagon like a Honda. <laughs> Shit, no, me, oh God! Skating on niggas. Let me see. What, what was uh, track sixteen? D-Lo, Flintstone. Tight shit. That's light work. My feet hurt. Need Rick arms. Make them sixty racks just to smile, bitch. I don't need ice, babe. Go ahead, grab that. Where I'm from, you ain't got no money. I yeah, get laughed at. I stayed up and joins on. I put Gucci on your toes, baby. Me and Dollar nigga, wrist icy froze, baby. I got work. I got. Okay. Flintstone, what you that think bit, of that, that one? Bit, it's smooth. It's gating. You ain't getting tired of the subject matter yet? You still... Because <laughs> at this point, we know he about to say he a real street nigga. And we're gonna, definitely going to say, hey, baby, like you look Gucci. better with a boss. I put Gucci on your toes, baby. <laughs> he going to say that. You know what I'm saying? We know what he pretty much going to say at this yeah. point. You know what I'm saying? Uh, the 20 songs was OD. Yeah. I'm going to be real. 20, 20 songs was OD. a lot, dude. man. Especially if you're going to be like on staying the on the same shit. subject matter every like, single nigga. <laughs> Hard times? You know what I'm saying? A motivational song, yeah. it's a RP song to it, like a dead homie, like a. Yeah. You know man. what I'm saying? So it's. it's I'm like, I ain't gonna lie, twin. That shit repeat, twin. <laughs> That's what I said, man. <laughs> shit. 20 songs. Let's yeah, keep it going. Boy. Track 7, D-Lo, Gucci. Yeah. 100 on a Louis belt, 600 on Cologne. Huh. AP costs like 80 G. Oh, Bitch, my money long. Dog. <laughs> what? 800 on Cologne. <laughs> uh, like, like, we get it. You get money. <laughs> <laughs> nah, you ain't get it yet. He got three more songs to tell you this nigga getting money. Like, nigga, make sure little Rick know. <laughs> you see them Cuban links, boy? I'm from a Hey, whatever, well. Baby, I'm a hoarder, huh? Real trouble, I can sell a fish water. Wanna do? I got plenty of money. If the police get behind me, I'ma hit it on the president. Holy Catch shit. me in traffic, boy. Which <laughs> thing, track 17, D-Lo Gucci. That nigga get money. <laughs> Papered up, bro. Oh, God, that nigga got stacks on stacks, dog. It's everywhere. Damn, nigga. Give me some. <laughs> Yo. 
That's crazy though. Uh, like, damn, he, he probably can't rap about really nothing else then. Cause mm -hmm. he would've did it by now probably. Out of 20 songs. Yeah. Yeah, if he had anything in the arsenal, he would've emptied that bitch out. Probably on the intro. Exactly. On the intro, yeah. Like, the first four, five songs, you know, whatever on your chest, whatever on your heart. Because at this point, we don't really know nothing about, like, Boss man. besides you get money, like, we don't know, you know what I'm saying, like, like yeah. intimate details, you know what I'm saying? What like, you been through. Yeah, shit like that. What it was like growing up in the hood. Right. Where you from? Like, you said you from Florida. I ain't yeah. gonna bullshit. I knew that a little bit. I ain't know. <laughs> like. I definitely didn't know. Hey. Shout out to Bar Boss Man d -Lo. Let's keep it going. Track 18, Boss uh, Boxing Night, featuring Babyface Ray. Type shit. Uh-huh. Don't fucking say nothing to me in my ear, cause when I leave, I'm not gonna remember that shit. But y'all niggas really be trying to act like y'all saying something to me important. But I don't give a fuck what's going on. Boss man d playing. I'm trying to hear this shit, bro. Play that shit on TNT. Ah, hell nah. That's bands falling off my ass, 50 bands in it. I jumped in that water, grabbed the pot, and put some sand in it. Uh. We some both sad niggas, we gon' pay the price, baby. I was grinding all kind of nights, I had prayed for this. So I'm up on him. I say, baby, you so fine. She say, baby, you him. I say, baby, you got that shit on. She say, baby, you Trump. Rich ass nigga, I'ma put yeah. Foreign car whipper, I'ma put some hoes in it. Whole chicken out the trap in it. What was that? Dude? <laughs> he go say, he go what? <clears throat> That's the old girl. Man. The hell? <laughs> Oh, I, I want to say, I want to say he was gonna. He was trying to say we gonna pull up and shoot because he said we gonna put up. Like, why would they leave that in though? Why they wanna re record it? Like, maybe, maybe he just, he just couldn't. He just. <laughs> And you feel like it? Yeah, you leave it like that. You leave it like that. I gotta go, bro. That nigga heard it. He was like, "That shit kind of hard." <laughs> like yeah. Yeah. Niggas, niggas in the back, like, "Yeah, that's, that's hard, bro. hard." That's your hard. <laughs> you already know. Benny ain't got a stove in. My youngest sitting in the car because he can't get the road. One of those niggas camo Valentino down like a Holly Grove nigga. Fucking gold diggers, bitch. I'm Rose Gold Kitty. Licensed in our skitty, getting low from the stage. Yeah, boss ass nigga. Yeah. Nigga, yeah. I can, fuck with, it. I can fuck with it. I can fuck with it. It's like, it got a vibe to it. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. It ain't, you know what I mean? Just like, all the red stuff, so like, it got a little. You can I mean, vibe it's, with it. It's, for me, it's cool, but I don't see myself listening to it a bunch of times. Uh -uh. I might listen to it one more time, but I don't think I'm going to be running that back like this time next year. You know what I'm saying? Three I can, months. From I now. can see them playing it in the club. You think so? That's going to make it to the club? That's going to make it to the club. Because it's a vibe, like yeah, that's what I'm saying. When you when you grab like he got 20 songs on the album, mm -hmm. and all actuality, niggas probably gonna fuck with maybe like a <laughs> solid five songs for real. Yeah, I'm <laughs> talk about that too. Yeah, I gotta so, change this damn light. The light going out. I ain't never, I ain't never seen this nigga like I done heard niggas say, oh, I ran the bus man, D-Lo. Oh, yeah. word. But like, it ain't, you know, it ain't, it don't move. You know what I'm saying? Because my thing is, if he drop two more albums that sound like this, like, like, <clears throat> I think people gonna get tired of it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, but let's it, see. You know what I'm saying? It's like, it's like, if you making music, and you, if it, you gotta be able to paint a picture. Exactly. You gotta be able to paint a picture, like not just of what you're telling in the song, but who you are as a person. That's what I'm trying to get to. Because when you are. I'm not just an artist. I do a lot of different shit. Right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And I, it's my job as me being who I am to to show you who I am. Yep. Now, me talking about I got bitches, I get money, mm -hmm. I'm from Florida, that shit don't do nothing for you, fam. <laughs> like, if I'm going through some shit and I feel like what I'm going through can probably help somebody else going through the same shit I'm going through, being relatable, then I'm doing my job. But me bragging about what I got ain't doing shit for nobody else. And like you said, you connect better like when your fans can really relate to you. Like most of Boston fans ain't got money like that. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? So of course that's cool for the club, but give them else something. I would give them something else to relate to besides the fact, you know what I'm saying, that niggas got money. Yeah, nigga nigga can work a nine to five job and get money. Exactly, right. <laughs> like 
Money come, money go, problems be forever. Pretty much. If you ain't dealing with them. Let's keep it going. We almost done track 19 called <clears throat> Four Days. Uh, yeah. Nigga. Street's going crazy. Nigga. Got hoes for days. Nigga. Bitches beats off. I got Zion lows for days. Nigga. I be dripped out. I got the Zion clothes for days. Damn, bitch, like you nigga. Can't get I got hoes for days. Right. Kick his pussy ass out the circle. He a rat. That nigga play. play. He say he wanna. Uh, Okay, bet I'm on the way. I'm a <laughs> like, I be drilled. I, I got designer clothes for days. It like it like he'll say it like it like he'll say some real shit. I get money, nigga. <laughs> like damn, nigga. I mean, we know you get money, nigga. But stay on topic, nigga. I got clothes for days. Bitches beats off. I got Zion lows for days. I be drilled. I got designer clothes for days. And now, bitch, nigga. I got hoes for days. Bitch, shot in the mall. That ain't cost shit. Try to go against me, and he lost it. Bitches beats off. I got Zion lows for days. I be drilled. I got designer clothes for days. I ain't chasing now, bitch, nigga. I got hoes for days. Bitches beats off. I got Zion lows for days. I be drilled. I for days. Like if you don't listen to the whole album, and you heard that, you be like, yo, that be hard, son. <laughs> Oh, nah, that's that's another one of them ones though. I'm gonna be bumping that. Yeah. Today when I'm running my errands. I got hoes today. <laughs> Dead ass. All right, we finally to the last song, y'all. Type shit. You feel me? Track 20, shake that ass. Featuring Glorilla. I ain't even know she was on here. Oh yeah, you, this, said, this you my... said that. Before, <laughs> yeah. that was like last song. That nigga said we gonna put this bitch at the end. <laughs> Yo, them, them all. Oh, I know this. So this yeah, is that song that be on TikTok. Yeah, I'm about to say I heard this beat before. Oh, you might heard this song. Say that song, baby. Get it over the twerking, baby. Mm. You know you doing that shit on purpose, baby. That pussy water, that's some water. Let me serve it, baby. Yeah. What about this one? This shit on the flow. I can't lie, I'm telling them super fucked up about my whole day. Yeah, throw it back and let them go and record it. Uh, I'ma get money ass nigga. Uh, and I ain't chasing shit unless it's money and liquor. That's some water, let me serve it, baby. Mm, that ass perfect, baby. Mm, yeah, that shit. Let's make some noise one time for D Lo. Type shit, type shit, type shit. Boss man D Lo live from Florida, you feel me? That's the last, that's the last track. You know what I'm saying? So I'ma start with mines, man. Out of these 20 tracks, my favorite tracks was Mo Chicken featuring French Montana. I forgot all about that already. I gotta run that back. Type shit. The biggest part two, game winner, <clears throat> PJ featuring Lil Baby, Four Days, and Shake That Ass featuring Glorilla. I got what? I got six songs out of 20. What you got? I got, I really didn't put no stars. I really just wrote down the ones I wanted. I got, I like Mo Chicken, uh -huh. the biggest part two, mm -hmm. game winner, mm -hmm. what you need featuring No Cap. Mm -hmm. Pushing up for days and uh, the last one was skate out with it. Shake it ass. Shake it ass. Yeah. Yup. Yep, I fuck yep. with it. I fuck with it. Yup. So I mean, six songs out of twenty really ain't a good percentage, really. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Um, I would rate this album. See, like I rate mine on a scale from one to five, two point five being like an average album. Mm -hmm. So if I was to rate this, I give it a, uh, I give it a three. You know what I'm saying? I think the replay value for most of these songs ain't big enough for me to give it like a higher score. If it had more replay value and really felt like an album and not like kind of like a mixtape in my opinion I just wanted a little bit more from him you know what I'm saying so yeah, um, yeah I would give it a 3 out of 5 like what, what would you rate it? Uh, I'd give it a 2.5 ain't even I average album. Album. yeah like because it's too many songs <laughs> like that's, that's really what got me bro it's just <coughs> it took a long time to listen to that 20 minutes nigga we've been here for an hour, hour. <laughs> like, that's a long ass time. And I ain't even playing all the songs. Like, I cut them off, like, you know what I'm saying? Sometimes, like, before it got to the end. Like, nigga, you'll be driving from fucking Georgia to Florida <laughs> and be done with the whole album by the time you get there. Like, yeah. you start that bitch at one, you at 20 by the time you get get to the crib. It is what it is, man. Yeah. But yeah, let us know what y'all would uh, rate that in the comments um, and why. Let us know what you would rate it and why, what you would rate it and why. You feel me? Um, and that's it for this episode of Ill Music Reviews. But, um, Stay tuned though, because really we about to talk about what Lil Rick got going on right now. You know what I'm saying? So shout out to D-Lo Boss Man. If you see this, keep doing your thing, King. You know what I'm saying? We rocking with you. Yes, Salute. sir. Yes, sir. So, the homie Lil Rick the touchdown in Georgia. Yes, sir. How long you been here now? I um, mean, I grew up in Georgia, bro. I've been here my whole life. Oh, for real? I don't know why. Yes, I thought sir. you said you moved from somewhere else. No, I was, so I'm ba I was born and raised in Milledgeville, Georgia. Okay. And I came up here like five months ago. How, where is that? Like compared to Atlanta, like it's South Atlanta, um, Millersville. Yeah, yeah, actually, that's exactly. It's um, South. 
Yeah, it's like making. Oh, okay, by making. Okay. Yeah. So, you know, I've been doing music for about, what, the past two years, maybe? And I just started coming out here really doing my own thing, just following God, trusting the process, you feel me? And you got a lot of competition out here, you feel me? Like, what would you say to somebody, like, would ask you, like, why should I listen to you when I got all these other rappers I'm trying to listen to? I think just having a conversation with me would make you want to listen to my music. They got to just have a conversation? Yeah, like, the way I think, the way I am, who I am as a person is just, it's, I'm an individual. Like, ain't I, nothing I do copying nobody, you know what I'm saying? I ain't trying to follow no way. I don't care about what's the hottest thing I got. I'm me. You feel me? And what, what would they say uh, they compare your music to? Like, when I was doing my thing, they said I sound like a mixture of Kanye mixed with T.I. based on my style and what I was talking about. Like, who would you say is kind of similar? If if they like that artist, then they gonna like Lil Rick. I had somebody, I, had, I, I, I get very few comparisons, honestly, but the most recent comparison that I had was Schooly. Somebody said I sounded like Schooly. Okay. And I think Schooly it's Schooly Cole. Yeah. They were really like cold. they were like your speech pattern just like it's like his. Mm. But my own flow, you know what I'm saying? And when you say like if <clears throat> when you do your music, what can they expect? You know what I'm saying? If you drop the album, what can they expect to hear about? Realness, bro. Realness. Problems. Problems that's um, like situations, bro, like trusting people. Mm-hmm. Just, you know, being a human being, bro, like, you know, I ain't got no bread for real, you know what I'm saying? I'm just a nigga out here getting it, following his dream, you feel me? So will your album sound more like a J. Cole album and less like a Boss Man D-Lo? Definitely. More like a J. Cole album? Definitely. That's hard. That's hard. You like collaborating with, like, uh, singers and stuff? Or? I collaborate with anybody who got talent, bro. For real? Anybody who got talent, bro. Whatever type of song you want to make, give me the outline, you know what I'm saying? And we can work. I'm going to try to do it. Like, however you want it made, mm-hmm. we can make that bitch. I guarantee you. Could you hop on the pop track? With pop? pop artist? Oh, yeah. You good? Yeah, man. My mom, man, my mom grew up listening to... Lord, half of these people don't even need to be mentioned today. <laughs> man. But she used to listen to R. Kelly, uh, Usher, you know, all them boys, man. I'm mm-hmm. on 90s kid. So, yeah. you know, like, my mom grew up in old 1998 and 2000 mm-hmm. art, like Nelly, all them boys. And yeah. So, you know, I was very versatile. My grandma used to listen to, like, 80s, like, 80s classics and shit like that. So, I was always well-rounded when it came to music, for real. Yeah, and what about, uh, cause you also dance, you know what I'm saying? How long you been been dancing and what's the pathway for that? Well, I've been dancing since I was in diapers. I ain't even gonna bore oh, for real? it. Yes, yeah. uh, since I was. That's crazy though, I'll say this real quick. My daughter, she's about to turn two and uh, we named her, middle name is Melody. Cause every time you play music in my girlfriend's stomach, she'll start moving. That's tough. And now she's two and you play some music, she, getting she gonna try to show you her new moves. <laughs> She be killing them. I was Man. like, that's my daughter, boy. She hear that music, she get turned up Man. every time I'm playing music. So you've been knowing, like her dancing since you was in diapers. Yeah, um, I grew like, I used to listen to, like, how can I explain it? I used to watch music videos. And yeah. you know how music video was on one of yeah. Park back in the day. They right, had right. niggas dancing and yeah, shit. Of course. Shirt bust all over, screaming all types yeah. of shit. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, when you grow up, Watching stuff and seeing stuff like that, you see the music choreography, like the dance choreography and like the music videos. Uh-huh. Then you watching like you got surge, stomp the yard, right. uh, step up to the street. Like you watching like drumline, all that shit. You like shit. I could probably do that shit. Hey, they gonna bullshit. Now you in front of the TV at two o'clock so, in the morning. So right. would you, you want to? Would you want to be like um, like a background dancer for like a, a usher or anybody? You know what I'm saying? I you you fuck with that? You pay for that? I would love to do that. I remember. Um, one time I was in the um, army. Mm-hmm. Shout out Uncle Sam. But <laughs> but yeah, boy. But I was in the army, and one time I had uh, I had DM Chris Brown one time because I was looking into like you know being a backup dancer. Mm-hmm. He ain't never hit me back, but you know it was the effort that counted. Yeah, you gotta keep. You gonna get a lot of no's. Shout out Chris Brown. You get a lot of no's, but them yeses, know, but them yeses, them yeses is coming. Oh you know yeah. You just stay on that path, and then so like. Tell the people like what you looking for, like what you need, like from the, the other creatives in Atlanta. Man, all I need is studio space, bro. Studio time mm-hmm. and studio space. Like, you got the beats, you got a vision, or you want to give me a beat packet and you want to put something together. Like, I'm here working, bro. Like, I'm here just for the grind, bro. Nothing more, nothing less. I ain't with no drama. I ain't with no issues. Mm-hmm. You got 
something going on, man, keep that shit to yourself. <laughs> I'm telling you, keep that shit to yourself, my boy. Like, if it ain't business, I ain't there. How hard is it? Because you like, how old are you? 26. How does it hard, easy is it for you to stay focused? In Atlanta, a lot of shit going on. You get caught up and moving around because you, you can do a lot of shit in Atlanta. You get some shit easy. Yeah, I How mean, you stay focused? it's just uh, my upbringing, man. My upbringing made me be able to stay focused because I used to, I've always had stuff going on around me. Like, ever yeah. since I was a kid, bro, like, mom and dad used to get into it all the time. I Folks at school used to bully, bully niggas all the time. Me too. Yep. And it's like, everybody got this to say about you. And it's like, shit, as a kid, you don't even know who you are. Exactly. You still so, out. yeah. And so, like, it took me, like, being in the military and just going through shit and really just locking in with God for real, bro. Yeah. Like just studying the word and just being who God called me to be. And mm -hmm. just even now, like just being in a situation that me and my brother in, bro, like shit, we got to lock in. Yeah. Because if we don't lock in, we ain't going to eat. I've been there. I was exactly. definitely homeless chasing this dream. I was homeless in 2014. I almost froze to death in my car. So, <laughs> so you understand exactly what the yeah, fuck yeah, going I on. I spent all this money on like mixtape beats and all kind of stuff. And I was like, damn, is this real? Man, <laughs> well, I, I thank God that I'm here right now talking in this music review. Like, this is my first music review. And I thank God that I'm sitting right here in this moment, bro. And I'm grateful to see this too, man. A lot of motherfuckers going to see this. Because uh, Kelby going to promote it. Tampa gonna promote it. The girl's son is gonna promote it. Then I'm gonna promote it. You promote it. A lot of people gonna see this. So run it up, run it up, stack it up, stack it up. Kind of the, kind of the racks, hey. <laughs> and so, where, how can I get in contact with you? Like your social medias and. Oh uh, man, all you can that. hit me on Instagram at lyric underscore for real. It's l i l r i c underscore f r. Um, my TikTok, I can't tell y'all that because I don't remember off the top of my head. Mm -hmm. But definitely follow me on Instagram. And all my links is on my Instagram. Uh, shit, just like that, we out. Peace. Type shit.